See if I get attacked by a warhog again. Get to Libertad. Steal a boat. Sail the fuck out of Yara. Easy. Easy peasy. And now I'm talking to myself. Perfecto. Ah! <laughs> oh fuck. <laughs> Well, that one easier than last time. Yay, I got meat. Take that. Ah. So I'm not sure how far I'm going to get into this game. I've, I'm honestly, I've never beaten a Far Cry game before. Um. On. Let's see. Far Cry 1, I've only played a tiny bit. Bad time to be a guerrilla. Um. I have it on my computer. I've barely touched it. In a while since I used one of these. I've also like I also got the uh, the council version, like the vengeance or whatever it was called. <clears throat> Same thing. I've, I've I've only played a tiny bit of that. Never gotten far into it. Visitors. Far Cry Two is actually the first Far Cry game I ever played. That one, I I actually got a decent ways into that one. Um. Probably not halfway, probably not that Wanna far. show your face before you shoot me? Show a face. Hi hey there. I'm Danny, a friend of Lita. Silencio. Yes, Far Cry 2 was an interesting experience for me because I'd never played an open world game quite like that. Like, my open world experience is more Grand Theft Auto and Driver. You are the, the only survivor. The malaria, I hated that. Answer me. I said, are you the only survivor? Si. Lucky. Lita knew the risks. That's all you have to say? You're here. That's what matters. Just a second, hermana. I'm getting the hell out of Yara. <laughs> but you're in my camp. I need a place to stay. A few days. Libertas no charity, hermana. Lita said you'd help. Lita also said you weren't a pussy. Come mierda. You're an orphan, see? Funny how friends can be closer than family. Remember, Danny? Castillo has kept you an orphan. Why do you want to run? I watched Castillo order a whole boat of our people shot to death. Get as far away as you can from that psychopath. All of you. <laughs> when tyranny is law, revolution is order. Quoting Bolivar won't save you. It's Pedro Albizu. Gonna save Yara with library cards. I have a list. Free elections, free expression, free the outcasts. A Yara free of Castillos. Simple. Simple. Castillos got what? 300,000 troops, I count six burnt out guerrillas, and you, with a bullet to the leg. You don't believe me? I'll show you. We launched an attack from our base to this island. It was a basic operation. Hit a Viviro tobacco plantation, snatch some fuel, and go home. But Castillo's forces were waiting. Got us down from 60 to 6. You need to get back to your base. Yes, but this island is surrounded by a blockade. We don't have boats, we don't have much gear. And we are not leaving until that Viviro plantation goes up in smoke. But we are guerrillas. We know this land inside out. You're already familiar with our guerrilla paths. They were built by the legends in 67. They're spread like a web across all of Yara. Now, they're ours. Guerrilla paths are good to ambush soldados or to hide if the army is on your back. They have caches that will help you survive. And all of this is legit? This map is old as hell. Made for turistas. Yeah, it's out of date, but you got the regions, municipalities, and landmarks of Yara. You'll get used to it. Now I need to call in some favors with the locals to get us a boat, and you need to go find me Juan Cortez. Who? Someone who can make one guerrilla fight like a thousand.
You know I'm not a guerrilla, right? You tell Lita that? I'll give you food, a bed, even a goddamn boat to sail to the Yankees. But it's gonna cost you bullets and blood. You can shoot, so shoot. Settle in, and let me know when you want to pay your rent. Yeah, 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 let's go get Juan. I attacked this archipelago with a man named... Get down to that village and bring me Cortez. I hope for your sake he's sober. I'm not really going to let this in Gao stay here. What's the problem, Julio? The problem is we're not a fucking jury. Alright. So, yeah. Um, barely spent any time with the first uh, Far Cry. Second Far Cry. You're not one of us. Blah 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 blah. The uh, arsenal. What's pictured there is not what she's wearing. I wonder if that's like the picture is like the the guy. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> Anyways, the second one, I was loving the the free flow, like the taking out the enemy outposts and everything. Ah, oh, the fire was awesome, and it made me laugh that no matter how much he damaged every vehicle, you could fix it by just tightening a bolt on the uh, <laughs> the radiator. But the malaria, I hated dealing with that. I imagine I probably got somewhere around 30% done with that game. Far Cry 3 was the first one where I put a lot of time into it. Loud and clear. The spy shit works, Clara. I'll give you that. Yeah. Keep your gun holstered if you want to stay out of trouble. Especially in areas with a lot of soldados. See, I got it. A smart guerrilla picks their battles. Suerte. Yeah. Yep. Already did it. Good job. <laughs> uh, Far Cry 3. Like, I loved Vaz. Um, I loved the, the island and everything. And... When I went to the new island with the harder enemies, at first I was all for it. But I just... I quickly wasn't as invested. I didn't really care about the, the new big bad. I kind of burnt out on that one. Red Dragon. I need to go. I barely touched Red Dragon, and it seems like it's right up my alley, so I need to go back and and beat that game. Actually, I got the special edition of this game, so I think that included Red Dragon, if I remember correctly. Far Cry 4, I was really excited about, but then the way... um, I, I didn't like the verticality. I feel like I was spending the entire game just climbing to get anywhere. Never had any areas where I could just wander and explore. You know, kind of like this. And, uh... Then... We're looking for a man in one for Please, I don't want any trouble. Oh, they're looking for the guy I'm looking for. Then, like, you'd have helicopters and you flew too high. They would, like, freak out and crash. So, yeah, I found four kind of annoying to navigate. To be continued. <laughs> Today we drink in the worst fucking cantina in Yara. Or is it Colombia? Kirat, Chechnya. Leave the bottle. Let's work for you. Another. Guapo, you listen. Rule 16. The Guerrero's revolution never ends. Always another war, another cantina, another ugly bartender. I love Guapo. Juan Cortez? What do you think gave it away, Guapo? The 
Thinks he's in a fucking zoo, abuelo. Clara sent me to find you. See, I learned long ago never to doubt her. You will too. Hey, I know you. Don't think so. Yeah, I know you. It's like I'm looking at a mirror, Wapo. What are you talking about? Those eyes, guerrilla. You got a taste. You convince yourself you're a hero, but you wake up a junkie, just like Juan Cortez. This is a fucking waste of time. Can you whistle? What? Nah, you can't whistle. Coño! Fala, venga! <laughs> you fucking rat. You're worth more dead anyway. What the fuck? See, what boy is in love with you? <laughs> and I ruined the only copy of my book. Bueno, mis socios! Vámonos! Once again, we have outstayed our welcome. Him, guapo. Better have at least some shot left in there. Oops. Jeez. I slid right by a cover. We're in this way now. all the way up there back to the fray okay we're good let's get the hell out of here before the whole oh, fucking shit. army shows up i'm drunk but i'm not that drunk right behind you old man yesterday he was yelling things like uh bite and roll to guapo all right, got my ammo. Who's a good dater? I'm coming. Wapo wants to be your friend. Or maybe he just needs to take a dump. Only one way to find out. Come on, let's get the fuck out of here. Oh, I was gonna pet him. You were flashing. We're fucking around. Let's go. I'm trying to grab. I'm on fire. Stop yelling at me. I like the gold tooth. Good croc. You're more distracted than a coked up house cat. Vamonos. That's a scary thought. Can I knock these in the water? Well, you handled the gun before. <laughs> Yay. What the fuck are you doing? Let's go. <laughs> I'm a coked up house cat. You just said it yourself. Is talking. I can tell you handled the gun before. Oh, back to that, huh? Name? Danny. So Clara says you're a legend. Ex KGB, ex CIA. <laughs> I got more fucking exes than your porn search history. Some men, they break eggs for breakfast. But Juan Cortez, hold up. New plan, Danny. Vamos. Juan Cortez the plan holds is up. To go back to Clara's camp. Where the hell are we going now? <clears throat> See that smoke? Yep. That means the watchtower just got a supply drop with some of the rarest materials you'll find in Yara. And you are going to go get it. Now you want me to steal shit for you? Gunpowder and Supremo Bond. 
the cerveza and chaser of Resolver. I'm gonna teach you to make shit for weapons, because making shit for weapons is cool. And it's rule number nine. Always use the right tool for the right job. You coming with me? Fuck no. You got Guapo. You can tear shit up with him. But if you want to be sneaky, leave him behind. That cutie loves to make a mess. At least you're here to help, Guapo. Guapo, move! Hey. Weapon or not, military will shoot me on sight here. Completely silent. I think it did it. I guess this could be useful. I guess. That's everyone, so now I'm free. Free to explore glitches. Are they both down there? Yes, there. <laughs> I'm too easily abused. Uh, got the strap. For one. What the? Is more like it. Sweet. People of Yara, 
an announcement from El Presidente Castillo. I'm easily amused. I was just noticing, like, you can see the grass squat, uh, crushed down where they're supposed to be. Who's so good, Cocotrilo? I seen something? Oh. Oh, geez, the biggest one. I didn't grab the biggest one. I was so busy killing people, I forgot. <laughs> I'm sorry. Found all your shit, Juan. That's what I've been saying. Okay, we got more than enough. Let's get the fuck out of here. <laughs> 